Hello. Nomads Cult uh, Cat Series Part 3. I called it Techniques. Um, I show only the easy ones um, in this video. There are coming more videos. Um, okay, I switch to the Nomad app. Um, the plan is another other video um, how to get it inside uh, Nomad. Um, but we use it in this um, example. Okay, um, we need walls um, and for the walls we need a box. In the topology, change uh, the division to zero. Zero is always good. And adjust the box. Um, you can use the handles to uh, resize it. And you can give it uh, in the material box an uh, additive and uh, reduce the opacity. Then you can look uh, through it. Um, you can also adjust uh, the color if you want, um, but I leave it in white. Um, okay, now um, you can position the points where the wall is. Use the handles and in this view in the you can bring the, the wall in in the right height um, it it must be uh, so exact uh, it don't um, as a you can trim it later um, <laughs> that's okay um, and you um, don't validate <sighs> don't validate the object uh, because uh, now you're able to um, adjust uh, the length and uh, the, all the handles you can easily adjust. Um, on the left side, there's a clone button. Press the clone button and now you have a second wall. You can bring it in position. And the, you can do it with every wall you you got uh, clone it um, and bring it in position um, adjust it from the length and uh, the dimensions and you can scale in in the plan is uh, of course uh, also possible um, and Yes, clone it again. Next wall. Okay. Um, what happens here? Hmm? Have I rotated it or? I don't know. I think it's correct, okay. As I, mm. uh, you can use, uh, you can, uh, on the rotation cube, uh, you can lock it. Um, that's better uh, not to, um, and turn on the outline. Okay. And now the view is correct. View is locked. That's good. Okay. And um, now the next step are the other walls. Uh, you can clone it and you can adjust your rotation setting. Um, you can uh, do it with a pencil, uh, drag it uh, and uh, adjust it or you can um, put it manually in inside um, um, with a got a got tester tool. Okay, and now you can rotate it in forty five degrees steps and bring it in position. Okay, um, and then you can do this walls.
Okay. This is easy. Good. Uh, now unlock the view um, and uh, go to this wall, for example, and um, go back to opaque. And now when you um, have to trim the walls, um, validate it. And when you want to, uh, to um, uh, trim uh, windows inside, uh, then you have to uh, split the objects. Um, use the split function, the rectangular tool, and in the settings, uh, you can use whole fill holes. Um, turn it on um, and, and reduce the details uh, or zero. It's good. And now you can trim uh, where the windows are and for example here and here's a window And this part, select the part and uh, trim the next window and so on and so on. And this, um, this part um, you can um, delete, delete it only. Um, you can select it and uh, the selected one you can delete. Um, so you can do it. Um, and when you want to adjust the, the walls in, for example, in the height or mm, you can select this wall, go in the left view or in the view that you need, uh, use the selection mask, select the, the part, this part, and now you can use, um, sorry, we, there's the gizmo edit on, turn it off. Um, and we can use the gizmo and then you can adjust the size of this uh, part. And now you can adjust uh, the height of the uh, window. Again, um, you can do it like this. And when you're fine, when you're happy um, with all your walls or so, you can press and hold the smooth button and select the parts of the wall. Now I think we got all. And now you can simple merge this object. Now it's a, a complete object again. And yes. And when the work is done and you're happy with all the, the settings, you can also uh, remesh the object at the end. Then the, the wire is like this. Okay. For this video, it's enough. Okay. Have fun with sculpting. Ciao.